Hey restaurant owners, in this upcoming video, I'm gonna teach you how to get 30 minutes, an hour, or even two hours back in your week so you can work on the things you love to work on or even enjoy a little more freedom in your life. Stick around and watch the video. I'm gonna teach you something I call the activity inventory right now. Hey restaurant owners, my name is Ryan Gronf and I'm an author, speaker, chef, restaurateur. I'm the founder of therestaurantboss.com as well as clickbacon.com. And I'm gonna teach you how to get, gosh, even 30 minutes back in your week. See, chances are when you got into the restaurant business, a lot like when I got into the restaurant business, see, I was a chef, I loved cooking and I thought I can go and partner up with someone and open up a restaurant, I would just get to cook all day. But I'm sure like you, I found myself doing administration tasks. I found myself dealing with people a lot more than I wanted to, with customers, with marketing, with all kinds of things that we knew we would be doing, but we didn't really know we'd be doing as much as we were. And so whatever reasons you got into the restaurant business for, whatever your magic is, your talent, chances are you're not doing as much of it as you want because you're doing all the other things and you're getting frustrated because you want to delegate tasks to other people. You hear the word delegate and you hire managers to do things to, for you or to help you out, but then you hand them off and they come back to you and they're either not done or they're not done right and then you're finding yourself following up on them all day. And the reason things aren't getting done for you in your business is because you're the bottleneck. Everything has to go through you. Almost every decision has to go through you. Almost every new process or new procedure or new menu change or new marketing or new administration task or every fire, you're the only one who knows how to do it or put it out or answer the questions. The reason that is, is the word I just used. Things aren't systematized yet. You haven't put things into a system. So I've got tons of videos and tons of other trainings on how to create systems, how to manage systems and develop people but today, what I wanna to talk to you about is something called the activity inventory. When I learned this, it really freed up a lot of time for me because remember, in this world, you share one thing with everybody in the world no matter what. From the wealthiest people in the world to the poorest, to everyone in the middle, we all have the exact same amount of time. So how do some people get so much more done with their time than others? It's simple. They control their calendar, they control their clock, they don't let it control them. Now, what the activity inventory is, is it's just you simply going through your day and writing down all of the tasks and things that you do. Now, this sounds daunting and overwhelming, so I don't want you to spend a full week writing everything down because that list would just pile up and get huge. All I want you to do is I want you to go through your day and find one thing one thing that isn't your magic, one thing that you wish you didn't have to do, that you don't love to do, that you wish someone else could do, but isn't able to do or isn't doing right now because you're still the bottleneck. And then all I want you to do is I want you to create a very simple system around that, a documented process system around that. Again, I'm not getting into the details of it today, but just go and offload one 30 minute task this week. One thing that you do every week that takes you 20 or 30 minutes, take the time to document that. Take the time to write down the process. Take the time to train someone else how to do it and then remove yourself from that process. Next week, do it again. Next week, do it again. See, so many times we get frustrated and we think, my gosh, I'm never gonna get my freedom. I'm never gonna be able to take any time off because we're looking at it as this huge thing. But when you start inventorying it, when you start looking at the things that you're doing, it's 15 minutes here, 10 minutes here, 20 minutes here, 30 minutes here. It's not six hours. It's six hours that's made up of five, 10, 15, 20. And when you get 30 minutes this week and then 30 more next week and then 30 more next week and then after a month or two months, you've got two, three, four extra hours in your week that's where the magic in your business can really start to happen. When you can sit down for two or three or four hours and really concentrate on getting something big done. I hope you enjoyed this week's tip. This has been Ryan Gronfman with The Restaurant Boss and I look forward to bringing you another great tip just like this one next week. Have a wonderful day.
I wanna thank you for watching that video. If you can do me three really quick favors right now, very quick. The first is, if you haven't already, will you subscribe to this channel? In a moment, some things are gonna pop up on your screen, some buttons, and one of those buttons is gonna be subscribe. So whether you're watching this on my channel or on YouTube or on your phone, just stick around for one second and you're gonna see a big subscribe button. If you haven't already, could you please subscribe? Two, if you haven't liked this video, will you go ahead and click the like button? Actually, don't just click it, will you smash that like button and tell the world that you really enjoy this? Because the way that I can continue to bring you all this great free training is for my message to expand for more restaurant owners and future restaurant owners around the world to be watching this. And so the way to do that is to like my video. So again, if you're watching on YouTube, there'll be a place for you to like it. Or if you're back on my website, there'll be a place for you to like that. So smash that like button for me. And then also, could you leave a comment? Ask me a question. I reply to all my comments as fast as I can, usually within about 24 hours. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer. But go ahead and ask me a question, leave me a comment, tell me you love the video, tell me you'd like to see something else in a video. If you need more detail on a certain area, I can film other videos about that. But if you can go ahead, in a couple seconds now, it's gonna come out. If you can subscribe, like, and comment, that would be great. Also, there'll be a spot in, the, in this little button coming out in a few seconds where you can download something for free. I'm always rotating that, so take a look at that, some free tools. But if you're new to my channel, if you've never seen my videos before, There'll also be a spot for you to watch a video that'll kind of introduce you to what I do here at the Restaurant Boss and at clickbacon.com and tell you about what we do and how you can get more involved and how you can get more free stuff and all that. So the button should be coming in by now. Go ahead and click on those and have an absolutely wonderful day. Thank you so much.